part two of my review of Optimus Prime. Um, some things I forgot to mention during part one were that these wheels actually uh, fold, which were done like that, actually fold in and up. So he has a kind of a samurai armor kind of design on his legs. Um, also, I forgot these pieces are on ball joints, so you can move them around however you want. I usually leave them like that because I think that's a neat looking design. And uh, that's pretty much it in terms of transformation. Uh, as you can see, really, really awesome transformation uh, into vehicle, into a uh, robot mode. Uh, now onto the features of this figure. Uh, he does have the pop-out swords. It helps to flip this panel up a little just to get them to come forward a little. Like that. Kind of hard to get out there. Uh, they're very nice, very film accurate swords. Um, I did. Uh, they do look really good once you painted these uh, silver. Uh, you can do it here or in there if you want. I think it looked better uh, in there, as I think I've already mentioned. Uh, he does have the Mech Alive gimmick. For some reason, this side isn't working today. I'm hoping it's not broken. Um, but anyway, if you, there's a little flap right here. You just press it down and then push it up. It uh, makes a mech alive gimmick. Raises his head and say, makes him say, I am Optimus Prime. Uh, I'll show it off so you can see it. Uh, those gears in there move. Um, and... That's pretty much it for features. Um, I would have liked a better sound chip. Um, I would have liked I Rise, You Fall instead of I Am Optimus Prime. But this is okay, I guess. Um, posability wise, he's got uh, ratcheted shoulders, uh, rotating uh, elbow, uh, elbow joint. Kind of limited just due to that panel right there. Uh, fully rotating head if you uh, raise it up a little. Um, ratcheted hips, knees bend, and he's got ball jointed feet. Um, so pretty, pretty decently poseable. Not the most super poseable figure of all time, but definitely can strike some pretty good poses. Um, he's a little bit difficult to get to stand. There you go. Uh, but just an awesome, awesome figure. I definitely recommend pin picking it up. Um, I had it on my coming soon list for a while, um, and I'm hoping that the wait was worth it, because this really is just an awesome, awesome figure. He's really, really good. Um, when I first saw pics of this, I thought that the vehicle mode was either going to be really bad, or his robot mode was going to be very bad, and I cannot be happy enough that I was mistaken uh, in both counts. Both his vehicle and robot mode are awesome. Robot mode's a little bit more up on the awesome scale, but uh, vehicle mode is pretty good too. Um, and there you have it. Part 2 of my review of Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Leader Class Optimus Prime.